Where do you use spotlights at home? When to use downlights? What is the difference between the light from downlights and spotlights? This video makes it clear at once. First of all, the core difference is the lighting effect. Once it appears, it is basically a complete failure. Large beam of light usually 60 to 120 degrees, light is evenly dispersed. No obvious light spots and light dark boundaries. It can make the overall brightness of the space softer and more uniform. And spotlights are concentrated lighting. Small beam of light usually a 15 to 45 degree angle. The exposure range is also small. Will form obvious light spots and light and dark contrasts can highlight illuminated objects. By comparison, it can be found that the smaller the beam of light angle, the smaller the exposure range. The usage scenarios of tube spotlights are also different. Spotlights are often used for accent lighting, highlight decorative paintings, sculptures, exhibits, etc. It can also be used to illuminate small areas like a coffee table aisle. Downlights are often used in areas that require high brightness, functional areas like the kitchen and study. Downlights are the most suitable. Note that by downlight I mean anti-glare downlight. Other ordinary downlights have larger beams of light wider exposure range. But glare can be very serious. It is recommended not to use it. If you use downlights at home, by default, all anti-glare downlights can be used. As I've been emphasizing, do not have any form of surface light source at home. Once it appears, it is basically equivalent to rolling over.